Hi, my name is Eric Dibble, Regional Sales Manager at HF Scientific. In this video, we're going to cover the MTOL Plus lamp change. The MTOL Plus lamp usually lasts about four to five years, but when you start failing calibrations or get a lamp error after this time frame, you will want to change the lamp. Stop the flow to the analyzer using a valve upstream of the entire assembly. Disconnect the ESM from the junction box by removing the cable from the ESM. Remove the flow head from the ESM by rotating the locking cam and releasing the flow head. You don't have to disconnect the tubing from the inlet and outlet, but I recommend it for ease of access. Use a spanner wrench or needle nose pliers to loosen the locking cam on top of the MTOL Plus and remove the locking cam and the brown O-ring on top of the MTOL Plus. Now, there is a small snap fitting that holds the board into the case. Press this snap fitting with a flathead screwdriver to release the board from the case. The board will still be connected to the case half with the backlight wires, but now you have access to the lamp. Undo the terminal block with your fingers by lifting the two white clamps or loosening the screws on the terminal block. Remove the lamp wires. Remove the Phillips head retaining screw in the lamp retaining collar. Pull the lamp assembly, the lamp and the collar, straight out and discard the lamp assembly, but reuse the screw in the next step. Insert the new lamp, replace the retaining screw and replace the wires. The new lamp is a pre-aligned assembly. The wires can go in either position. Ensure the wires are tight in the terminal lock. To reassemble the MTOL Plus, you just reverse the steps of disassembly, taking care to push the electrical connector back through the case and seat the ribbon cables appropriately. As part of this process, I would recommend having a spare brown O-ring, part number 25105, and a spare seal kit to replace the seals. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any more questions, please reach out to the HF Scientific Tech Support Team.